I tell him if you see him right off my Sure. Well, my name is Magic John. If you don't know me, I'm a famous person. <laughs> what are you laughing? No, if you think about it, in every house, there's a room named after me. <laughs> Taking on a while, we'll get that in there. Okay, we're going to have a little fun today to start things off with. I always like to use a lot of people from the audience and myself to get them started. I need to find somebody from the audience. So put your hands together. Come on. Put your hands together. You know why? That way you can see what they throw at you. No, I'm teasing. Okay, we have a little fun. Jacob, if you will, hold out your left hand. Oh, he's smarter than I am. Hold on to the cup bottle. Are you thirsty? Shake it up. Hold it towards you. Hold it towards you. Now open it up. No, I'm teasing. Don't do that. Look you will. Take the two. With your right hand. I've got the same things, ladies and gentlemen. A Coke bottle, show the Coke bottle. Show the two of the dishes. Make sure the people in the cheap seats can see it. All right. Take the two, put it over the bottle. Let's do it. Lift it up, fill the bottle, put it back down. Put your hand on top. Turn it over once. Turn it over again. Turn it over one more time. Now lift off the tube and shut. It'll <laughs> <laughs> be a long show, ladies and gentlemen. All right, lift off the tube, fill it up. Put it back down. Well, let's make sure you got it right. Show the box. Put it back down. Hand on top. Punch. Twice. One more time, lift off the tube, and... <laughs> where, where are you from? You live here? We'll do this slower. You don't live here, okay. I think we're going to switch bottles. Let me have that bottle. You take my bottle. Show it off. Okay. Take the tube, put it on the bottle. Lift off the tube, put a bottle. Put it back down. Hands on top. Lift. Twice. One more time. One more time. Lift off the tube. And. <laughs> Give him a round of applause. He'll just go on to something else. We'll just. Let me have that one. Here, you can keep that. Give him another big round of applause. Thank you, Jacob. You can have a seat or a stand, whatever you're doing. You can post that. All right. Y'all ready for some more magic? Yeah! I've got some more magic, but you know how it works. I've got to have somebody from the audience to so put your hands together. Test. You like color test? We're going to try this here. 
what I always do, everybody knows it. The third edition of the two. What's going to back with this one? What's going to back with that one? What's going to back with that one? Are you coming with one? I couldn't tell how he was dressed. I'm just teasing. You want to try this again? Hey, if you will, take the bag, make sure there's nothing in the bag. Is it empty? Put your hand in there. Is there anything in there? Put your hands in there. I'm just saying. Hold the bag high above your head with one handle. Use your left hand. Yeah, left hand. Okay, hold it just like that. Hannah! Oh. Put your hand in there. 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 Do it my way, okay? <laughs> and you get a shovel to do it your way. Hannah, what color box is that one? Yellow. Yellow's inside the bag. What color box is this one? Yellow is inside the bag. Ask them how you look at the block of this one. Red goes inside the bag. Now, Hannah, what color block did you put inside the bag? Yellow, green, and red. Yellow, green. She looked pretty good, didn't she? Black, here we go. First time, what color? Red. Red. Next time? Green. No. Yellow. Yellow. Last but not least is what? The green. Stand over there, Hannah. Stand way over there. Keep the back high above your head. Look that up when you get home. Nothing in the tube. Watch very closely. Goes over all three blocks. Now you have a choice. Name any two blocks you want. Green and yellow. Name one of those colors, either green or yellow. What color? That leaves the yellow block. Look, ladies and gentlemen. Wow. Reach in the bag and show them what's in the back. The yellow block! <laughs> Give them a big round of applause! Put that over here. Let me have the bag. Give them another big round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much. All right. We're having little microphone problems. How many of you in the audience would love to see one of the oldest tricks in the world? Watch very closely. We're looking at him. Yeah. All you need is an edge. I mean, it's silk. You take the silk just like so. You wave it vigorously in your hand just like this. Watch it very closely because the silk will change into an egg. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Now, this is the best part. The silk always goes back to my pocket. Is that amazing or what? What's wrong? That changed into an egg. What's wrong with it? I don't see nothing. I don't see a hole. There's a hole. What? You want me to turn it over? You want me to turn it over? Yes. How about like this? No hole. There is a hole. Where? There was. See, I can see a red dot. What? He turned it. Yeah, I turned it over the other way. How's that? Oh, you mean on the back side? Yeah. How about if I turn around like this? Yeah. You know, y'all are some tough cookies. I know, I know. Okay, I didn't amaze you. All right, there's a hole in the air. Oh, yeah. I know, I know. I tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to show everybody how to do this trick so you can take it home and show your family, okay? What you do is you get two silks that look exactly alike, okay? Now, you get a plastic egg. This is laid by a decoy. Y'all ain't getting this, are you? Okay. you if if y'all drink more beer, I'm hilarious. Really, I am. Cut up. You get a plastic egg. Now, you get two silks that look exactly alike. Now, one of the silks, you put where before the silk? Now, you put it in your pocket. Okay, because that's the silk I'm going to produce later. Y'all follow that? Okay. Now, this is what magicians do. We do something called palming. I actually palm the egg in my hand just like so. Okay? 
So from your perspective, it looks like this. Now, when you're holding the silk in your hand, it makes palming the silk or the egg much easier. Y'all follow that? Yeah. All right. Now, when you're pushing the silk into your fist, what are you really doing? Pushing the hole in the egg. Okay. When you're done, you do what? Now you push. The, you produce the silk from your pocket. Okay. So this silk goes where before the shelf? In your pocket. When you're pushing the silk into your fist, what are you really doing? You push in the hole in the egg. When you're done, what do you do? You show the egg, you reach into your pocket, but it's what? The silk. Now, this is the important part. What don't you want to happen when you're doing this trick? What? Yeah, you don't want them to see the hole, and you don't want anybody behind you to see the hole, okay? But it's very simple if that happens. Watch very closely. You just turn the egg over like this. You peel the hole right off the egg, okay? Then you come over here, you grab a glass, and you show that it was a real egg the whole time, see? Thank you very much. All right. Y'all want to see more? Got a question for you. Y'all want to see a good magic trick or a bad one? Will you settle for a bad one? Yes, sir! Okay, I'm going to do a bad one. You do this, I need a guy to help me out. How about that guy in the camouflage cap out there? Come on up there. Give him a round of applause. Come on up. What's your name, sir? Joe? Joe, give Jason a big round of applause. The fact is, we're about to spell Jason. Right. Okay, do you have rope tricks? Do you want to see a great rope trick? Yeah. I thought it was a great rope trick. Joe, what I'd like you to do is make sure that rope is good. Make sure there's no magnets, no strings, anything holding it together. Jay, what is in your hand? What's in my hand? What's this? I just want to be sure. Jay, if you take the scissors, to do the rope trick, what I need, I actually have to have two pieces of rope, and they have to be the exact same size. So to do that, I'm going to take the two ends put together just like so. That's the exact same size, so I'm going to take the center of the rope, which is being about right here. Is everybody following? Yeah. Jay, if you will, cut the rope right there in the center. I like to get the rope. All right. We've got two pieces of rope that are exact. Go ahead and uh, cut that, Jay. Alright, we've got two pieces of rope that are exact same size, two here, two there, exactly the same. Me. Cut that no, I'm teasing. Right. We've got two pieces even here, even there. We've got two pieces of rope that are exactly the same. Jason is doing very well, is he? I'll tell you what we'll do, ladies and gentlemen. We'll just start the whole trick all over again. Is that not impressive? Thank you. But I'm still not done, Jake. Walk closely as I take the rope. I'll tie the rope together just like this. Let me have the scissors. I'll cut the rope in the center. And what looks like two pieces of rope tied together. Are you ready to do the trick? Come a little closer, Jake. Jake is going to restore the two ropes. Do you think you can do it? Say, I've got this out there. Say, put it out, it's really stupid. <laughs> I can't believe you said that. But it didn't work too. Maybe if you try it up here, maybe it'll work a little better. <laughs> Give him a round of applause, he did it. Oh. And we're still not done. I'll take the rope, put it together like this. If I cut the rope down here, how many pieces will we have? If I bring it up like this, can I say, how many will we have? Five. Four. 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 Four
That is not a lot of help for me. This is why I get everybody. If I bring this end up, bring this end down, try to even them up just a little bit here. Um, cut it there, cut it there, and then we have. Now there you go. Just go ahead and cut it. Cut it at the bottom. Now, if you notice something about these roots, ladies and gentlemen, they're about the same length. Is that correct? Y'all help me out here. This is rope number. This is course this rope number. This is course this rope number. What I'd like you to do, Jay. Say, Abba, say, Abba. You get it? Because now you're really medium sized piece. Over here, you get a short piece. And over here, you get a really long piece. Thank you very much. Go wait. Here's the short. Here's the medium. And here's the long. We'll try to even them up here. Short, medium, and long. Can you see that? Whoa. <laughs> hey, don't do that. Say, Abba, You did it. Give him a round of applause. Now we're back to the original three things. This is road number. This is road number. This is road number. Yeah. This is number. One last time. Hocus focus. Hocus focus. Short. That's yours. <laughs> this is the medium. And there's the long. Give Jake a big round of applause. You take the look. I'll take the scissors. Another big round of applause for Jake.